Hey everybody, Corey Martin here, former NFL linebacker, author of the book, Make a Touchdown of Your Life. So glad to have you in Touchdown Studios. Welcome. Today is your day. Today I'm going to talk to you about, about greatness and you discovering your greatness so you can be the best you possible. See, I firmly believe, again, I firmly believe that each and every one of you, you in particular, have the ability to be great. Have the ability to discover what your purpose and passion is in life and boom, go be it, go do it, go live it, and be the best at it. You know, I love what uh, Les Brown says, says, you know, you don't have to be great to start, but you have to start to be great. And that is so true. Sometimes we get so caught up on, you know, can I do it, will I do it, or this color's not right, or this picture's not right, and this should be this way. Forget all that. Just go do it and make adjustments on the way. You know, stop sitting back and waiting for everything to be perfect and right for you to live your dreams. Start now. You can always tweak here and tweak there along the way. So today I want to talk to you about kind of an equation I came up with doing a lot of my research and, 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 and talking to people who I believe are, are, are living that true greatness, right? Um, talk about, you know, D squared plus W equals G. D squared plus W equals G, and G being, of course, greatness. So let's dive in. First off, we talk about the first D, right? of D squared, we talk about desire, right? You've got to have a longing for something. I mean, you've got to have strong will. You've got to want something. you got to desire something, right? Desire you, a new career path, right? A new, uh, a, 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 a new, uh, uh, company you want to acquire, or a new job, right, or, or to live financially free, right, desire something, travel more, have more time with the family, you got to desire something, right, desire something. On top of that, you have to also have determination. Determination. You have to have it. No matter what, you have to have it. You're determined to get it. Period. There's no if and buts about it. You're going to make it happen. So maybe it is, right, starting your own business. I love to speak to entrepreneurs. Starting your own business, right? Starting your own company, right? You got to have the desire and determination to see it forward. To find your greatness. There's one more we're going to add to it. Because without this one, it's not possible. We're talking about intent. Right? Deliberate action. Deliberate manifestation. Right? Intent to make it happen. So desire plus determination plus will. You've got to have will. You've got to have a strong inclination that this is going to happen, period. No matter what. Knock down five times, 20 times, so what? I will get there. You know the story about Jack Canfield, right, and Mark Victor Hansen. They were turned down by over 150 publishers before they got their first yes, right? They, they, were, they had desire, they had determination, and they had will. You have to have desire, determination, and will. When you have all that, D squared plus W, then you find the greatness. Then you find your absolute greatness, which is where I want you to live at. I want you to live in greatness. I want everything you do, right, to be about being the best at it. Not just going through the motions, not just lollygagging around, that everything you do, boom, deliberate, action, present, focus, bam, drop my pen. 
right? Be deliberate, be focused, be at it, be in tune with it. Be in tune with it. That's the only way you find your greatness. By challenging yourself to be great in everything you do, in all aspects of life, business, relationships, social, spiritual, all aspects of life. So again, the greatest equation, D squared plus W equals G, desire plus determination plus will equals greatness. I hope this video has served you. Thank you for being in Touchdown Studios. Remember, it is always your choice to get off the sideline and to get into the game. Have a blessed one.